So, Hapsan Challenge! So, we are here at Gyodae to eat gopchang with our guest here. I'm Flora, I'm <laughs> from Norway, and I've been living in Korea for three years now. So, in Korea, gopchang is like a food that only the butchers used to eat, but nowadays it's really popular among Koreans. Why? Why is it so popular? I don't know why. <laughs> let's find out why. <laughs> <laughs> so, let's go find out. Let's go! Oh, okay. this is gopchang. This is the tang. Ah, oh, so this is big intestine and that small intestine. Yeah, yeah. It's really chewy, but I, I like the texture. Is this your first time eating gopchang, the tang? No, I have had it like um, a couple of times before, but not like this. So do you like it? Yeah, I really like it. Actually, before I came to Korea, I never ate like the fatty parts of meat. Because in Norway, we just like cut them out completely. Yeah. So when my mom came to Korea, when they ate samgyeopsal, she was like cutting out the parts of the fat. Oh, or just the good Yeah, part. right, right. Because it's just, for us, we think it's so unhealthy. I mean, we eat a lot of butter and olive oil, yeah. but then still, yeah. <laughs> in gopchang, it's called gop. You know, when you chew something, something pops out, right? Ah, right. Did you like it? Yeah, me. Really? Me, I like it. Yeah. I didn't like it at the first time. <laughs> Maktang? You like maktang better than the tang? Yeah, I think it's a little bit less chewy. Foreigners, even though they come to Korea, they don't really seem to try this kind of food because it's it maybe kind of disgusting at first. Right, right. You would think that it's not so good, but it's good. It's good? But you have to get used to it. It says it's good. For me, it was kind of hard for me too at first. Even if you don't like it the first time, try it one more time mm -hmm. and you will get like addicted. It will yeah. be worth it. Especially with alcohol, right? With yeah. soju. Yeah. Actually, you gotta have some mekchu with this. Oh, really? It tastes so much better than. Mekchu pa? I heard that this is really popular with girls in Korea. Like, why? Is it because of the taste that girls like it or um, why is it famous? A couple of years ago, there was this famous K-pop star called Hasa came out in one of the main TV shows in Korea. So like she ate gopchang in a very delicious way, so it went viral. And also since that it's good for their skin. The reason that Korean girls have such beautiful skin is because they eat a lot of gopchang then. Yeah, probably, <laughs> I think so. If you want skin like her, you should eat gopchang. This one kind of looks like if you eat sundae, and yeah. then there's always some... It, it's liver. A Not the liver, it's the heart. Yongtong tastes a little bit more like meat. Just right, like meat. it does. Yeah. This one is really easy to eat. Yum. Mogonni. <laughs> and it doesn't have any aftertaste. It's very like a clean taste to all of this. What, what's this? So it's the stomach. Let's try it. Done. Very soft. Yeah, it's a, it's not chewy. It's really tender. It's totally different, like how it looks like. Like at the end, it's a little bit chewy, but it's not as chewy as the gopchang and makgeolbang. I think I like this part the most because it's not like really chewy. For me, I still like makgeolbang the best. <laughs> <laughs> you need to go for the gopchang. Yes, it like finishes the meal. Oh. In Korea, you need to have a big stomach. So it's always like first round, second round, third round. Oh, 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 oh. Going for the second round, bokkeumbok. Second round. Oh. Wow. That looks so good. Oh, it smells great too. Korean bokkeumbok always smells of sesame oil and it's like the best scent in the world. It has its own unique smell and the taste is amazing too. Let's try it out. Do you like it? Mm. Mm. <coughs> I ate it too quickly. I like how it's fried with kimchi. The great thing with kimchi is that if you eat something oily, you feel really full. Uh -huh. But then you eat like one piece of kimchi and then you get refreshed. Oh, you mama, mama. Yeah. <laughs> She's a Korean. She's a Korean. So how would you rate this food? I would give it like a 4.1 out of 5 because it didn't have any aftertaste. 
but it was really fresh. Sajangnim, he told me that they use kiwi for making it tender. Yeah, I've never heard of that before, <laughs> like using kiwi. I loved it. What about you? How would you rate it out of five? Gokchang, like as a food, for me would be five out of five. We ate it like three different ways now. So basically first it was like a little bit boiled and then it was fried more. And then it was bokkeumbap. The first one was maybe three points. Eight, mm -hmm. and then the second one was four, and the bokkeumbap is like five out of five. It's, it's elevating. Really yeah, it's <laughs> elevating. Thank you for watching today. We'll see you in the next food street. Bam.